We take democracy for granted. Yes, me, you, and most people around us. Most of us were born in democracies, and the dark days of the 20th century seem a long time ago. So why do we need to worry? Well, yes, maybe democracy is a bit under stress in Turkey, and well, yes, in Russia, and some of what Donald Trump is saying in the US is worrying. With all that happening around us, what will it take for us to realize that liberal democracy is not as secure as we used to think? That it's not guaranteed even in the EU as well? That basic principles such as the rule of law are in danger? The founding fathers of the EU lived through occupation, dictatorship and world war. The European project was designed to ensure that these things would never happen again. Perhaps we've become complacent. Blaming the EU has become a national sport. But presenting an easy solution to a complex issue has a name. It's called populism. And populism can threaten liberal democracy. Political programs in 140 characters are dangerous. Because once voted in power with easy solutions, some attempted to change the rules of the game. And although when joining the EU, strict democratic credentials are required, we've not found an effective way to ensure member states abide by the rule of law once they've joined. As socialists and democrats, we firmly believe that democracy is something worth fighting for. At the core of our identity lies the belief that the EU should ensure fundamental rights and democracy, uphold the values on which it was founded. And the only way the EU can and will come to those tempted to change the rules is by strengthening the rule of law. Yes, change is required to tackle current voters' mistrust, but that cannot mean damaging the principles on which our democracies are based on. That is something we cannot take for granted and must fight to protect.